5. Museums. Museums are special places building created for preserving historical information. These are places where information about people and past events are stored. Specialists in a museum who help explain objects to the people are called museum curators. They date and arrange the remains and artifacts which demonstrate in the easiest way possible the technological, cultural, economical and social development of the people. Their national, regional, district and local museums of East Africa. Examples of museum in Tanzania are Kalenga in Iringa, Bujora in Mwanza and Halwego and Handabezio in Ukurnu. In Kenya the Herricks Hill Museum site in Nakuru District, Kaanda in Uganda and many others. Advantages of Museums 1. They preserve the historical information and material. It is in the museum that many of historical remains are preserved for future use and referral. 2. They contain a variety of historical items. It is only in the museum that one can find a variety of historical remains ranging from artifacts to written records and oral tradition. Therefore a museum is relatively important to historical study. 3. Museums provide objects that give history a practical touch, as they work as teaching aids. Students of history have the opportunity to put into practice what they study as they see the objects in museums. 4. It is possible to learn about the development of technology of early man from museums. The curators play an important role in explaining artifacts to the people and how they were used. 5. Museums arouse creativity and craftsmanship on the side of the learner. This comes about as the learner sees more and more remains and become more eager to discover more. Disadvantages of Museums 1. They are very expensive to maintain and build. Starting up and maintaining a museum requires a lot of funds. Obtaining and maintaining artifacts is also relatively expensive. 2. Require skilled manpower to operate. Museum curators should have historical bearings and know about the artifacts in the museum. 3. Distortion of historical information in the museum is possible when the curator is biased. The curator will therefore distort the historical information, as he is subjective in the way he interprets the historical facts. 4. Attitude of the people affects the museum so much that some museums have been forced to be closed. People are not visiting museums due to unknown reasons. A case in point the Herrick Site Museum in Kenya says that it receives only 10-20 inches customers on a busy weekend which is very small number compared to the inputs in the museum. 5. Poor preservation of artifacts. For example the pieces of cloth, chains if not well handled can distort the information and the relevance of the historical facts. Due to poor preservation many museums have lost their historical artifacts to the fires other unforeseen circumstances costing them dearly.